Good Thursday morning. Welcome to the Beamish Blogcast. It's October 22nd, 2015, and I hold in my hand the latest drought stats that just came into the Forewarn Weather Center. And check it out. We are drought-free not only in western Pima County, but all of Santa Cruz and much of Cochise counties. In fact, the moderate drought status dropped 9% from last week and much of the viewing area just considered abnormally dry including us here in Metro Tucson you can thank the wet monsoon and El Nino for that. We begin to dry out though as we're heading into the afternoon hours. 76 your forecast high in Tucson with mostly sunny skies. Overnight lows in the low to mid 50s across the old Pueblo. Clear, cool and crisp as you're waking up on your Friday morning. We're watching two features that will be impacting our forecast over the next 48 hours. Here's the low pressure trough responsible for the showers and storms the last couple of days. Now moving well off to the east. Meanwhile, further west than that is a new storm system and that's going to graze the northern portion of the state on Friday. Both of these systems are probably going to touch off a couple of isolated showers for the White Mountains both this afternoon and Friday but for the rest of southern Arizona the warming trend is on. Daytime highs this afternoon a good six to eight degrees below average for this time of year but then we see those temperatures skyrocket into the upper 80s this weekend. Could see some gusty winds develop out of the east up to 25 miles per hour Saturday and Sunday, and then the breezes ease up as you head back to work next week. Thanks for logging on. I'll catch you on the TV side today for News 4 Tucson at noon.